Hi crafty cuties and welcome back to another haul in shop with me. Um, I attempted filming a shop with me and then my camera battery died then I went to my phone and that worked for a little bit and then I had no space on that so bear with me we're gonna do that at the end and I figured I would start off with showing you some of the things I got. I went to craft warehouse which is where I filmed a few shop with me and then I've got a few things from Joanne so I'll just show you while we are here. All right. One thing that I love about Craft Warehouse is they have a really good selection of single sheets of 12 by 12s. Now, I am not someone who typically likes to buy single sheets. However, they usually have some really great deals and they have some really unique um, pages. They have a ton of these acetate pages like all the time. They're like a thicker plastic or it's like yeah I don't know it's it's just acetate they're so awesome so I got a few of those because they had some that were Halloween themed like I just showed you there and yeah I thought that would be awesome to use um and then they also had some Halloween prints and I was running a little low on the Halloween papers that I had um, and since I figured I would be using these, or since I would be doing October dailies, um, I figured it would not hurt to pick up a few really cute, unique pages that I could use maybe for um, the covers of the books or, you know, something like that. So grabbed those. Um, I was on the hunt for some fabric, actually. Um, by the time this video is up, I believe my journal release will have already been done. But I was looking for some type of like sun and moon or celestial type fabric for a dream journal. Um, I didn't find anything, however, I found this really pretty kind of spacey galaxy looking uh, fabric. and. I thought it was super pretty. I thought that even if I didn't use that as a cover, I could probably use this to make some tags or I've been really into making like patchwork type fabric pockets. And so I knew that I could use this like in any type of journal, but maybe I'll use it for the dream journals. Um, I just needed some thread. I've been needing to s buy this like every time I go to the store. Um, if you guys know the bleh, bleh, the best place for me to buy thread, let me know. I assume it's probably somewhere online, but it definitely adds up when you're buying it like one spool at a time because this was $2.99 and it's 400 yards. Um, I don't know how long it'll last, but I'm sure I will need to get some the next time I go to the store. Um, and then I've been looking to get these hinge clips every time I've gone to Joann's and Michael's and they've just always been out. So they are a little bit more expensive at Craft Warehouse. They are $4.50, whereas Michaels and Joann's, they're usually $3.99. But since I wasn't able to find them recently, I figured I would just go ahead and pick those up since I am needing those for my journal release. Then I went to Joann's because I wanted to check one more place to see if I could find some kind of dream, dreamy uh, fabric, which I did not find. But of course, they got me on some other stuff. And I didn't really overdo it, but uh, they they actually had these in stock, of course. And I did have two coupons. I had a 50 and a 40, so I was like, all right, I'll get these because they'd be like two bucks or maybe a little more than two. I think I used the 40 on these. So, um, and I go through these like crazy. So, um, yeah, I just really like the Tim Holtz ones. I've tried Recollections and they're fine, but they're just not as sleek. They're not as pretty and they're not as, um, like skinny. So these are just so perfect. So I stock up on those when I can. This is how I have actually been buying my thread rather than the singles. And, um, this usually seems like it's a pretty good bargain because it is... $6.99 but I use this is not focusing but I used my uh 50% off coupon so ends up being about $3.50 and I do like that you get all of the different colors um not like my favorite colors but it's nice to have a variety because I do like to have colored thread on my um pages and um, this seems like good quality thread although I don't really need like great quality since I'm sewing paper but it's just you know it works and each one's 110 yards there's seven spools so 
I don't know, maybe that's not that great of a deal because that's about 700, 800 yards for 350. Eh, maybe that's fine. I don't know. They actually have a way bigger one that has the prettiest colors, like a really pretty mauve, mauve, um, some like grays. And, um, it's $19.99 though, but it's a lot bigger. It has like, I feel like it has like triple the amount. So it might not be a bad idea to use my coupon on that, but I would love to hear where you guys get thread if you do. The last thing I picked up, these charms were 50% off. And again, you can tell I'm in dream journal mode, but I could use these really on anything. Um, I'll probably use them on paper clips for the um, edges of the books. And I think these were about $2 after the 50% off. So that was everything that I got. You should have saw my pile at first because uh, Joanne had a $5 off $30 purchase and I was like, hmm, you know, I could like stock up just to use that $5 off. I had all this Tim Holtz stuff. It was stuff that I definitely could have used in my journals, but at the same time, like, if I continue buying more supplies and just continue putting really expensive things into my journals, then I'm going to have to obviously raise the prices. I don't want to do that. So I put it all back because it was not things that I needed at all, but Tim Holtz gets me every time. Anyways, guys, so let's hop into the clips that I did get from the shop with me and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. This little display I thought was kind of different because there is some very purple related holiday papers and I don't think that, I'm not sure if these are a certain paper line and I'm just not seeing it, but these are pretty and I feel like you could use this for more of a wintry look, like look at that pretty tree. So that's cool because it's different, but then guys, oh boy, then. Simple stories, very merry. Look at these. Well, of course my phone would die. I mean, my camera died. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to hurry now because I'm on my phone, but some really cute embellishments. I mean, I think that this line is new. I, I can't keep up with the different lines, but I love how they have the single papers as well. So yeah, oh, and then Simple Stories, Oh Holy Night is another and I like these sets also because it gives you some stickers and some of the papers and you usually get like a cut apart as well so whoa of course I would knock everything over but these are the stickers that come with this one these are the stickers that come with the first set super bad glare there we go very cute so they also have, I think, some more Halloween stuff. So let's go take a look at that. Here's a kind of an overview of what it looks like. And then I kind of forgot to show you that there are these pieces as well, which would be great for December daily. All right, let's head over here. They have a lot of great fall related paper lines as well, which is nice because that way if you want to get started with, you know, fall crafting but not quite go into something like Halloween, this is super cute. I'm not sure, yeah, these are stickers, really cute. Oh, sweater, what, sweater weather. So this is authentic, bountiful. These are so cute. Oh, I love the little acorns. Are you guys excited for fall? I mean, especially like fall crafting. How can you not? Do I like these little cute embellishments? Oh my gosh, for like cooking. <gasps> How cute is that? And then I think this is what we just looked at, but this is a six by six. Then they also have the little project pack here. And that one comes with the stickers. So yeah, that's $19.99 right there. I might have to come back on Monday. They have, I think, 50% off. But anyways, there's lots of summary things too, but I believe we've looked at these in past Shop With Me's. <gasps> this is cute though. Look at this. This is like for camping clearance. Very cute. Okay, let's see what else they got. 